There's apparently no area of life in which statists and collectivists don't think they have a right to insert their big fat noses. Who uh, should get to use a particular bathroom or how many bathrooms should be available would hardly seem to be the realm of uh, their concern, but they've decided to make it so. Private businesses should be the ones who decide um, whether they have bathrooms or who should use them or what the conditions should be. Uh, because murkier with public, uh, i.e. government-run organizations such as schools. Um, but the main issue here is that the hypocrisy that these people exhibit, that for example, the NCAAs and other organizations have um, said they will boycott North Carolina unless they change their uh, rules limiting the, uh, how bathrooms should be used. Um, now, they claim that this is somehow violating the, the rights of lesbians, gays, transsexuals, bisexuals, whatever, how many special groups they have nowadays. But in reality, this would affect only a teeny tiny percentage of the population, uh, probably less than 2% or 1% even, probably less than that. Where, where's their outrage when states such as California or Connecticut pass laws infringing on the Second Amendment? limiting what people can buy or where they can carry uh, weapons, uh, laws that threaten to f affect any adult uh, in that particular jurisdiction. They blithely ignore those kinds of violations, um, whether it's Second Amendment, First Amendment, Fourth Amendment, uh, drug war, anything. They don't seem to be bothered by those kinds of major violations that affect millions of people. Yet, they get their panties in a bunch because of some controversy uh, using a bathroom. When you use a bathroom, just go in whatever equipment says that it is. You know, I don't care. Get a private room, individual room where you lock the keys with keys. But don't pretend that you're somehow moral or more righteous than anybody else uh, by claiming to be boycotting these out as, as some moral high ground. They, these people have no moral high ground. They don't give a rat's ass about fundamental rights or freedom or personal autonomy or anything. They just want to throw their weight around. They don't want to persuade people. They want to use the force of government to get what they want. And that uh, just simply makes them bullies because none of these areas are areas that government has any say in in the first place. I defy anyone to find in the U.S. Constitution or any state constitution anything about bathrooms. But don't get me started.